Hey, 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 everybody. This is Dr. Eve Angel Savage. Hey, Shades of Diva. Thank you for joining me. Please share with your followers. I am going to share some great stuff with you guys. I am giving away a free ebook. The free ebook. Yes, I'm going to tell you about some of the secrets I've been using. Some of the things that I have learned from publicists. Yes, Shades of Diva, thank you for sharing. I am going to share nine great principles. Hey, Bishop WBW, thank you for joining. I am sharing my free ebook with you all tonight. I want tonight is the only night that I am going to let that book go for free. And this book is centered around public relations and how to be your best PR. Many people have businesses set up and they're set to go, but they're not getting the increase in profitability that they need. And a lot of that is simply because of exposure. So we're going to be talking a little bit about the nine principles, and I'm going to do this real quick. Nine principles that are related to being your best PR. These are the principles that I use every day in business. Why are they important? Because you, without customers, have no business. Lost my audio? How you do that? Can't hear me? Can you hear me? Maybe I should turn it up. Let's see. Okay, my tone is all the way up. It's storming here. I'm not sure if it's my area or if it's yours, but anyway, we are giving away this free ebook called My Best PR, and it discusses nine principles that are critical to individuals in business. And so I'm going to tell you about those principles. Hey, get fit virtually. Girl, I went on Black Biz Scope today. I had a wonderful time there. Yes, I did. I made my 100K, girl, killed it, yes. So those are some of the things that we have to do in order to get out of our own way, yes. So I'm talking about my ebook that's coming out August 1st, and it's being given away today for those who sign up today to receive that book. It talks about the nine principles of public relations. Do you remember that class, that workshop I did get fit virtually? Do you remember that workshop? Well, the workshop is now going into an ebook. Yes, an ebook. Yes. Did you think that those were some great principles for business? Do you think that everyone should have those principles? Yes, I believe so too. Had a great time teaching that class. I teach it throughout my community and everybody who is in business, if you're trying to brand yourself as a professional, if you're trying to brand your business, if you're trying to brand your nonprofit, if you're trying to get prepared for awesome investment readiness, public relations is critical. So what are the, what are the fundamental principles? I'm going to review those real quickly and I've put inside my bio or inside my title the website that you can go to to get that free ebook. You have to sign up tonight, tonight, please share with your followers, tonight to get it for free. Then on August 1st, it's going to go up to $3.99. After that, it's going to go up to $7.99. So I'm allowing you the opportunity to get these nine principles in an ebook format that are going to help you guide your practices in media. So the first principle is establishing your goals. What are your goals? It's in your business plan, but they always change. Activities change as your plans change because plans do change. The moment you put the ink on the paper, you're going to be changing and evolving as a business. And so it's very, very important that you know how to be looking at that and not be married to that plan because goals do change. Hey, Tro now I know her name. Is it Tracy? Is it Tracy? Is it Tracy? I know I see your handle, but hey, honey, thank you for joining me. The first one, please share this with your followers. Thank you so much. The first one we said was establish your goals. 
the second the second one is determining the audience you must determine your audience hey amanda moiselle glad you could join us we're talking about public relations and as it relates to business as it relates to a professional hey love how are you as it relates to um your stage you just need to be putting these principles in place determining your audience do you know that i just really figured out my audience you know i had an audience before used to be youth development i had an audience after that audience change every year direct services then it became professionals now i i have a for-profit business my market is always changing but i have really gotten to the point now where i've established that those people who i do business with will be those individuals who want to be investment ready or who want to increase their profitability by being investment ready even if they don't want to get investment but that's crazy so anyway open your distribution channels very very important that means creating opportunities doing certain systematic things that open up your distribution channels hey Desiree God is blessed hey sweetie good to see you yes I'm sharing some nuggets about being your best PR the next one is getting your product reviewed if you have a product I miss you too if you have a product then you need to have it reviewed one of the things I used to do in and when I first started my for-profit business is I would go out and I would go everywhere I network and I love to buy things right so I would buy 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 out because I love to support people so I would go and buy 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 but I would also come back and use the product and I'd go on YouTube and then I would review the product because I like to give away love now if I didn't review it nine times out of ten is because I didn't like it okay or maybe I just didn't have time okay share this with your followers and I think it's good that we also have a critical eye so I don't think it's necessarily good that we not tell people the truth about a product because therefore they don't have a way to improve that product so that is something that you know I'm beginning to to think about um the other thing is exposing you to national print media Very, thank you for putting that up national print media is critical you don't want to stay in the same place we don't have to stay where we were which means that you have to be exposed to national print media how do you do that you learn the principles the fundamental principles of public relation news release press release internet release all kinds of things you can do you'll learn inside the book another thing is using wire services for national promotion you know that's a big deal um, wire promotion many people don't know how to use or tap those wires like we do here in this space to um, promote your products. Another thing is, let's see, obtaining TV and radio coverage. Why do I know that's important? Because when I started Audacity, that's how I started. I started out podcasting. Podcasting and interviewing people because I just was into putting people in their place, putting people on stage, promoting business. You know, it was like, really, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to help people move to the next level and that's where I was until I learned that I needed to kind of put some of those products in place for myself as well so that I could earn money you know because I was promoting the, the productivity of people I am sleepy but I do not want to leave okay I'll be finished shortly um I have positioning yourself as an expert everybody you're an expert at something if you work how many of you work I work I work and I work and I work I worked for 30 years and on each of those jobs, I gained a new set of skills. Gaining new sets of skills is your intellectual property. It belongs to you. Those are the transferable skills that you can use for business. The, the next one. And that positions you as an expert. So what if you've only been in business two or three years? You gained some experience on that job, just like I did. Another thing is advice on your website or your squeeze page or how to get moving with a website or a squeeze page. Something that you can use that's going to send people back to you. Okay? The next one is using social media and the internet to promote your business. Like right here.
Okay, give me one more second. I'm going to let you answer that, ask that question. Then the last one is media training. How to get media training that's appropriate for you. So one of the things that I enjoy doing is interviewing. But I want more than anything for you all to have principles and principles that you can use to grow your business. So hop on over to bit.ly forward slash my best PR. Now what's your question, sweetie? Now we're open for Q&A. If you have questions about this topic we're talking about, feel free now is your chance to ask the questions that you have for me. Okay, it's off topic. Okay, go ahead, Desiree. You about to start something. I know you are. Because <laughs> you my girl. That's my 22-year-old baby, y'all. <laughs> That's in my best PR. Oh, 20-year. You 20-year-old. My 20-year-old baby. Go ahead, Desiree. Right. <laughs> I remember it. <laughs> oh, well, I sing. Okay, let's see. God has smiled on me. He has set me question any <laughs> you did start something girl you always starting something <laughs> that's my baby girl though oh, cool. <laughs> no more I'm so tired I just came back from a um, poetry event so I'm a little tired but I wanted to get out there and let people know about the, the book and how to go ahead and Oh, go ahead and sign up for that book so that they can um, get the free ebook tonight. Okay, well, go ahead to sleep because I'm about to, too. Thank you for the beautiful hearts. Thank you for hopping on over here. I appreciate you. No, ma'am. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, Desiree. <laughs> you just want me to sing you to sleep. That's all. <laughs> Desiree. Mm-mm. Now, mommy not doing it tonight. <laughs> Go to bed, because that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to have this tuna fish sandwich from Jimmy John's. You ever heard of Jimmy John's? I'm so tired. Guess what? I went to a spoken word event tonight, and I went to the event and to support my friend. Like I told you, I'm always doing something. And... <laughs> I want some tickets to a masquerade ball. I was like, yes, go on a date with my husband. So we're going to a masquerade ball. I haven't been to one of those since I was, God, 20-something. Thank you. Yes, I won something. I got out tonight, and I won something. I was so excited. So now we get to dress up. Yes, put on some mask and don our mask and wig. <laughs> And go out and ha on a date. I love dates. Dates with my husband. So anyway, I'm going to get off this scope. Desiree, I'm going to probably scope a little bit tomorrow. I hope to see you. Look forward to you being there and sharing with your friends, okay? I'm going to sleep. Love, love. Hey, girl, you came back, huh? Get, get fit virtually. You came back. What you scope popping tonight? One more song. Look, Get Fit Virtually, she got me singing. Desiree got me singing tonight. <laughs> Periscope. Are you periscoping? You had a periscope? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, well, you can catch the replay. I did a scope on um, my best PR. Yep, and then you see Desiree had me singing, girl. So if you hear me singing out there, that's why. Desiree, my little 20-year-old baby, she hopped up on the screen. And ask her mama to sing something. 
<laughs> Desiree, no more tonight. <laughs> Let me see if I can find another one. Um, let's see. Welcome into this place. Welcome into this broken vessel. Your desire to abide in the praises of your people. Oh, we lift our hands and we lift our hearts and we offer up the praises to your name. I'm going to leave it right there because I feel like that's a very important that we welcome the Lord into our space because we are living in a very trying time. And I have decided that I am not going to allow my mind to um, or to be diverted, to, um, to be sidebarred by, by the things um, of the world. And yeah, it's time for bed now. And I believe that prayer works and I believe that the Bible is what it says it. God is who he says he is. And I believe that the Bible is doing is coming to pass. And, and I know that the things that I'm seeing are so hurtful. But but yet I love the Lord and I trust him with all my heart. And I hope that you all do too. So I'm going to hop off of this scope. No more singing tonight, Desiree. Good night. Love you. God bless you so very much. And God bless you too. Thanks for joining. Bye, Matisa. Love, love, love you. <laughs>